in this lecture i am going to show you a real time application i have developed on code.org using the basic features of app lab with the help of this app a person can request the appointment from a doctor and the doctor can also confirm the appointment and send a notification to that person with the help of this app now how this app works that's what i would like to show you if uh, it's a doctor who is using this app so how he has to use it how he can access his uh, panel how he can access the admin panel with where uh, he can receive the notifications of the appointment requested or and also he can you know confirm the appointment so for that he can hit this uh, doctor's image and automatically he is going to get redirected on this beautiful admin panel okay now uh, if it's a user who want to use this app and take uh, the appointment of this doctor so for doing that on his device he can access this app and create his profile so first of all he is required to upload a pic for now i am selecting this pic and here i am going to write down the email address and then the user has to enter the password with which he would like to create his profile let's hit this login button and see what is going to happen hi your profile has been successfully created so the profile has been successfully created let's now access the profile using the login credentials with which we created it so these are the login credentials let's hit this login button and see what are we going to get welcome false we are done with setting up your dashboard you may now use it okay so the dashboard is ready and as you can see the user's id and his pic is getting reflected over here now in order to uh, get an appointment from this doctor over here he can this user can hit this button we sent your request successfully to the doctor hello the doctor doc. will respond very soon you just received a message okay so hello doc you just received a message so this is the speech which the doctor is going to hear and here uh, the doctor is going to see uh you know this letter kind of thing and this id with which he has received a message recently fine now uh, he can make use of these drop downs in order to uh, give an appointment to this person whose id is getting reflected over here let's select a month from this drop drop down i am going to select february for now and from this date he can select any date from uh, let's select 16 so it is 16th of february and at what time he would like to call this person so he, there are some time slots which uh, uh, the doctor can find over here in this third drop down uh, let's select this 9 to 9 15 am time now once the doctor is done with setting the things for all these three drop downs he can hit this confirm button Let's see what will happen once the doctor is done with hitting this confirm button. Thanks doctor for confirming the appointment. Hello obey at gmail.com doctor just confirmed your appointment visit the doctor on February 16th. So as you can see in real time you know he will receive the confirmation on his respective panel uh, you know the day and date whatever uh, the doctor has fixed for meeting this person is going to get reflected right on the top and the timings will be also visible to the user create one more uh, you know profile first of all i'm going to hide this uh, image so i am selecting uh, this pic for now profile i'm creating one more profile with this id and this username let's hit this login button hi your profile has been successfully created let's log in into this profile welcome false we are done with setting up your dashboard you may now use it okay let's hit this make an appointment button 
We sent your request successfully to the doctor. Hello, Hello doc. doc. The doctor will respond. You just received, received a message. message. Hello, Doc. You just received a message. So as you can see in real time, the doctor received a message from this ID nevi at the rate gmail.com. Let's select uh, one more date from here. So I am going to select, um, let's select 17 for now and let's change the time slot to 9.45 to 10 a.m. Or let's make use of this 9.15 to 9.30 slot. Let's hit this confirm button for confirming the appointment for this ID. Thanks doctor for confirming the appointment. Hello obey at gmail.com doctor just confirmed your appointment visit the Hello, doctor Nibby on at February gmail.com doctor just confirmed your appointment visit the doctor on February 17th. Okay so as you can see uh, Nevi has successfully received the day and date and time um, at which she can visit the doctor. Okay, so that's how this app works. Now let me show you the code I have made use of in code.org for developing this beautiful app. So this code which you're seeing right on the top is for uh, the sign up screen. Fine. So with this uh, code, the user will be able to create his own profile on this platform. And once he's done with creating his profile, he's going to get redirected on the login screen where he is required to enter the login credentials with which he created his account. And if everything is fine, which this code is going to check. So the user is going to get redirected on this screen. Uh, screen to find where he'll get to see his ID uh, reflecting over here and the profile pic which he uploaded while creating his profile over here fine now if he want if he would like to uh, request for an appointment what he can do he can hit this button and automatically a table with name appointment is going to get created now in real time uh, the doctor on his respective panel is going to receive a message along with the ID of that person who has sent him the message. Fine. Who has requested uh, from him his appointment. Okay. Now once he is done with uh, receiving the message, he can hit this confirm button. You know, this is a button which he can hit and confirm the appointment of the user. Now what will happen when he will hit this button? Automatically a table with name confirmed is going to get created in which all these things, email, day, month, time, everything is going to get saved. And on real time, the, all these things are going to get reflected on this user's panel who has requested an appointment from the doctor. So this is the code which is going to help us in doing the same. Fine. So that's how I have created this beautiful small uh, make an appointment app. Hope you guys enjoyed this lecture a lot. Do like and subscribe and also share the link of this video in your groups. And if you want to avail the coding classes facility, you guys are most welcome to do that. You just have to ask your parents to contact me on my phone number 9891665634 and get yourself registered for your for those online coding classes i am providing in just rupees 500 per month thank you very much god bless you all and have a great day bye bye